So here we go. We've got uh, this is a vase, one out of the few that I got the other day. And let's just crack this bad boy open. This one here looks to be something. So put this one off to the side really quick. All right. Here we go. All right. First step is these guys here. Just some white beads. Get these ones out of here. Oh, well, this seems same thing. They're cold to the touch, which means that there might be glass. These are definitely heavier than plastic. Let me pull these guys out if I can get some of this stuff undone. Okay. These are some pretty nice beads. It's older, they're knotted. No, this is. You can see the ridges on here. I don't know if you can see that in there. You can see the little line right here. That's where they're fused together. But we're going to hold on to those. Those are decent enough. This is just a junky black bead necklace. Can get rid of that guy. Uh, leather necklace. This little circle brooch. Nah, I'm not going to keep this one. Seems like there's quite a bit of brooches in here. Get some of these nut things out of the way. I don't know what kind of nuts these are, but you find these all the time. All the time I find those things. This one's decent. It's got a name on there. Let's see. Don't see a name. It's got a mirrored black, or mirrored back. We'll keep that one. It's pretty 80s-ish. This one says something. Oh, this is Avon. The old Avon purple one. Movies. Santa Cruz. What do you suppose that is? You think there used to be like a little movie on there? That's interesting. Have to keep this one just pull the back off. All right, so this backing looks like 1928 stuff. I'm willing to bet that's exactly what this is. 1928s brooch. We got another circle brooch. This one is not marked as well. I'm sure we won't. Oh, we got another one. Same one. Alright, what else we got in here? This is nicer. It's got a little bit of wear here. The gold's missing. But it's still doable. We'll definitely keep this one. I have to bend that guy. There we go. That's not a bad one. We'll definitely keep that. This right here is a gold plated piece of garbage chain. Missing a bunch of stuff on there. It's another brooch. It's like a little tassel one. Oh, it's marked. Trifari. There we go. Keep that guy. We got another brooch that's missing a pearl. There's no markings that I can see. We're going to get rid of that one. It's missing a pearl. This is nice. This might be something. No markings. No gold filled or anything. No. No. It's got too much plating missing, so we're probably going to get rid of this guy. All right. Now, what do we got here? This could be. I don't see any markings on there. Any, like, ivory markings. This appears to be like it could be bone. I don't see any. Ivory markings, but we'll keep that guy. That's a nice one. We'll go in our little collection of stuff like that. Well, here we go. I ain't that pretty. 
Look at that one. Is definitely pretty. See if I can't get that in the angle there. Very nice. There's a fossil bracelet. I'm gonna get rid of this guy because that is just not not gonna make anything. Here we go. We got some sort of. This looks to be like, it's definitely in Hebrew, I believe it's Hebrew. And I can't read it, obviously, but it appears to be like the wall, maybe it's like the wall you walk around, I don't know, I'm not too sure. Here we go. This is pretty. It's an owl stick pen. See that guy? Yeah, that's decent enough. We'll take that guy. Hey, we got an Indian something or other. Just heard my phone go off. Let's see, this is just a knotted necklace. Get rid of that guy. Here we go. Got some like close on a. That's pretty. Little blue flowers. I like that one. This one's broken. Get rid of that guy. This one here, I believe. Yeah, it's made by. It's uh, R slash M. I think it's R M Studios. I don't know, but then it's Mark Sterling, 1990, very 1990s, and 80s ish. It's cool. Keep that guy. What do we got here? Well, this is an older one. You can tell. You see this? You see the clasp on here? Right here. C clasp. This is definitely going to be an older brooch. And you see the hinge. And I'm willing to bet that that's sterling. Although I don't see any markings just yet. It could have been here. There's some marks on there. But I can't really tell. We'll have to test this one, but that's an older one. For sure. You can tell by the class. Oh, I've got another one of these. I found one of these recently. It's like a stick pin with a leaf on there. I'm not going to keep that one though. Oh, look at that guy. A little butterfly. That's fun. It was, it was being sold for four bucks. I guess no one bought it. We'll keep that one. We'll try to get some money out of that guy. Uh, junky old earring. This one is. This is Angel. It's marked Angel on the back. Nice little gold brooch. Not missing any gold, so we'll keep that one. Oh, here we go. Look at that. And that's in great condition. There's no missing gold. Usually with these ones, especially with this little like pattern here. Let's see this one. Oh, let's go. Usually with this pattern is that you can it wears a lot on the outer edges. But this one's marked Coro. Coro is a great brand. Here is a hat. Oh, here's a hat pin. We're just gonna get rid of that guy. Looks to be like a some sort of a sink screen or something. This one is also being sold. But I like this one. This is a rhinestone, gold and green rhinestone flower. That is cool. We'll definitely keep that one. All right. Another brooch. This one seems to be broken. We're not going to keep this one. It's it's modern, so we're just going to junk that guy. Leather. No, not gonna keep this one either. Yeah, we'll get rid of this guy. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. We got a lucky brand necklace. Hopefully it's not broken. I don't think it is. Oh, that's a different... Is that a different necklace? That's the same one. How does this work? How is this working out here, guys? Okay, let's see. This one comes down, maybe? This goes like this. Like that. And what does this do? Oh. There's a bunch of different clasps. It's just clasped on wrong. It's a lucky brand necklace. We'll definitely keep this one. That one will sell. It's in good condition, too. We'll take it. Some little clay bead ones. And this is a crown brooch. That's pretty. I like that one. Oh, we're going to keep that one. Alright, here we go. This is a Trifari. I can see the stamp on the back. A little gold one. That's cool. Keep this one for sure. This is like the vase of brooches, which I'm not mad at. We're going to get rid of this one. It's 280s ish. It's a faux gold and a faux pearl. Little teddy bear one. Look at this one. Let's see what over here. It's a hummingbird. We're definitely gonna keep that. Let's see. There's a little square there with something in it. Thought it might have been Swarovski, but it's not. This has got some greenage. That's not good. Nope. And no marks, so we'll just toss that guy. That's a pretty one. Hmm. That's a decent one right there. We'll keep that guy. Uh, some more black beads. More glass black beads. Get rid of those. This is just some junky necklaces. I don't see anything in here that's worth anything. Wait a minute. Nope. No marks on that guy either. We're just going to junk this whole thing. I will grab this guy though. And that one. Put that down. Use anything? Nope. Okay. Just a gold little pin. Nothing there. Another bird. Oh, that's a decent one. Look at that guy. You just put that down there. You see this guy? That's a cool one right there. I dig that. It's got a name on there, too. Oh, no, it's just numbers. A2761. We're going to keep that guy. This one's another gold. It's in good condition. We'll keep that one, too. This one here. Ooh, this one looks like it's actually gold. Or is that just cremets? Got my loop in my pack. It's not my loop, it's just my keys. I'm gonna grab my loop. Yep, cremets. Still a really, really pretty one, though. That's cool, I like that a lot. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, we're gonna scrap that guy. It's an art pin. A bottle of vino. But we're gonna keep this because it's... What does that say? Belle et Poule Champagne. I don't know. 
But that's definitely a keeper. I'm sure someone will buy that little pin. And then I see a Buddha. What's going on there? Look at all this. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's fun. It's a little marking on there. It says QT. I think this might be like a handmade thing. Forget me not. Little Buddha. I think that's probably a lucky thing. In a locket. That is something else. Oh, yeah. It's a little hair locket. You see that? Let me see if I can put that up in there. That is interesting. I ain't never seen one like that though. Doesn't really want to stay locked too well. Well, enough. Yeah, it does. That's fine. It's a forget me not thing. That is cool, man. We are going to definitely keep that. And then we got another locket here. Let's see what this one is. It's a 12 karat gold fill. Keep this one for sure. That is sweet. Uh, little chalice. It's got to be a religious pen. It's got like a chalice and some candles on there. Green Bay Packers. Tie clip. That'll definitely sell. They were trying to sell for a dollar, but no one bought it. I guess there's not as many Packers fans down here as they thought. Um, that's a little worn out. I'm gonna give that one a toss. Another one. Get rid of this guy too. W. No, I'm joking. Let's see. R. No. Look at that guy. <laughs> a fun little dog. We'll keep that one. Dog sell. Sometimes dogs sell, not all the time. Little pearl. I mean, uh, uh, what is this? A little bear. But I always break these flower things, so unless it's marked with no, we just junk that one. In here, 1983 Avon. Little pen. We'll keep that guy. You never know. I was born in 1983, so. And then we got Saturn. Yeah, we'll keep that one too. And might as well keep this one. Another Crements pin. What's this one? Danecraft. Is it Sterling? I don't see any Sterling marks on there, but this is Danecraft. So we'll definitely keep that guy. Fish. No. 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 Junk, junk, junk. A seahorse. We're definitely keeping the seahorse. Absolutely. Got M. No mark on there. We'll keep it though. A moon. It's a brass moon. EJB. Yeah, we'll keep this one. What they were trying to sell this one too. Two bucks. We'll keep that one. I'm sure we'll get something out of that. Um, Rose. Is this marked? No, it's Napier. A Napier Rose. It's another stick pin. Another stick pin. This looks like a garnet. It's a little out of place with the stick pins here. But we'll keep... Oh, and another one. T. We'll definitely keep these two. Not this one. Is this one marked with anything? Is that a marking? Let's see. No. We'll get rid of these guys. A bow. Junk. He is risen. Junk. Oh, that's fun. A little swan. Let's say Avon. We'll keep a little Avon Swan. Another little leaf type deal. I don't see any markings on there, but we'll keep it. It's in really good condition. Alright, now we got a. These are pearls. And they look to be real. And it says something on there 12 carat gold filled. Yep. 
12 karat gold filled. We'll definitely keep that one. Throw this guy away. This is, oh, look at that. This is a good brand. It's just unfortunate it's missing a stone there. It's missing one stone, but, uh, oh no, two stones. It's missing one, two stones. Uh, this is by a company, Weiss. And Weiss is a great maker of costume jewelry. I'll keep that anyway, so I'm sure someone will pick that up. It's only missing two stones. I'll put something in there. Uh, pewter. Is it pewter? Looks to be pewter. LCD. Uh, female golfer pin. That's it. Well, what the hell. Right. This is just a junky bracelet or a necklace. This is... This is definitely silver, and it's old. It's a C-clasp and the hinge, you can tell by the hinge. And it's marked maybe 800, I'm guessing. These are always generally 800. No, can't make that out. I'll have to do some more investigation on this guy. I thought it was marked there, but it doesn't appear to be. But this is old. I've been doing this for so long. This is definitely silver. It's definitely silver. You just see how tarnished that guy is. We'll keep this one. It's one of these circle brooches again. Oh, it's a little quill. We'll keep this one. Definitely keep the quill. <laughs> that reminds me of the Christmas story. But it's just a big old stiletto boot or shoe. I mean, look at that. Wow. I don't know how women can wear something like that. Uh, skeleton key type deal, a little lock and key. Keep that one. What does this one say? Napier. Get rid of that. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. This one would be cool if it wasn't all busted up. It's missing some pieces. This is another 1983 one. Keep that guy. Brass and enamel inlay flower. That's a, a keeper for sure. That's junk. That's junk. What do we got here? No, oh, that's gonna be junk too. Junk. Junk. Silver. No. Little butterfly guy. We'll keep that one. Ooh, 925. 925, little angel. I'll keep that one. And get rid of that. What's this one? No, get rid of that guy too. That guy. This appears to be silver. Yep, that's Mark Silver. We'll keep him. And is this one missing anything? Oops, missing everything. <laughs> get rid of this guy too. Um, junk. Junk, junk. Keep the glass one. Junk. Junk, junk. Junk, junk. 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 think there. No, we get rid of that guy too. Ooh, a little sparrow? That might be doable. And we'll get rid of this guy. It's cool, but it's not real. Junk, junk. And what does that say? Skyu? We'll keep that. These are the keepers. This is the junk. We'll pull out the junk. Ba -ba boom Dump this one in here. Alright, so here is the junk. This is all junk stuff. We'll just throw this in the garbage. And then these are our keepers. That's a cool one. Some beads. Some silver. This one is the... This is the pick of the bunch though right here. This is that hair locket. That is definitely cool. That's a, the find of the day in this one. Uh, another one. Some 
more pins, pins, pins. Let's see here. Oh, got some more bird ones. Bird. Bird. Coro. Is that Trifari? It's Trifari. Another silver one. Oh, this is a moonstone. I'm not going to be able to zoom in on this, I don't think. But that's definitely a moonstone. Let's see the shimmer off that guy. That's yeah, a moonstone. You don't see it's marked. But again, I've been doing this long enough. I know these I know these uh styles. That's definitely silver. Another brooch. Another brooch. Brooch. More silver. Yeah, this is just the brooch bin today. Wow. Okay. Alright, I think we're gonna stop there. I think you guys get the idea. It was a pretty good base. I'm not gonna lie, these were not bad as far as the finds go. Let's see. Yeah, those are those are definitely cool finds, but this one's definitely the winner. Probably the next one from these two guys, or these three guys. That one I'm pretty stoked about too. Uh also, that one's pretty cool. There's definitely some more over here. I just oh yeah, this one. That's an antique one too. Um, yeah, not a bad day. Um, I'll do another one of these uh, this weekend. So I won't be, I won't do one tonight, or I won't do one tomorrow. But I'll definitely do one the next day. So all right, see you next time.